But there's more bad news from China this evening. A new subtype of the Wuhan virus has been detected near Shanghai. It is something that the world hasn't seen before. China's massive outbreak is already making the world nervous. It could fuel another major outbreak in other parts of the world. China's own response is also weakening the global fight. Our next report tells you why. It is not over yet. The Wuhan virus has morphed again. A new subtype has been detected in China. It has been named BA11. It doesn't match with any existing variants. This virus was found in Suzhou, a city next to Shanghai. The patient is showing mild symptoms, but nothing can be taken for granted. China is witnessing its biggest Wuhan virus outbreak yet, and Beijing's response is putting lives at risk. The relentless spread has created the perfect conditions for a virus to morph and spread. Shanghai is one of the biggest hotspots in China right now. 26 million people are under a lockdown. Chinese President Xi Jinping has made a vow. He has promised to minimize disruption to the economy. Here is the result of that. Workers are living inside factories in Shanghai now. At this milk factory, almost 1,000 workers now sleep in every day. They sleep on sofas. Such measures might keep the milk factory running, but they also create an environment for the virus to spread. It's not just the factories. Even traders are staying in offices these days. At one of the trading floors, traders have been given air beds instant noodles and emergency kits to survive. The message is clear. Whatever happens, Chinese companies will keep their operations going. Some of the policies are downright inhumane, like this one. Shanghai health authorities are separating children from their families. If the parents catch the virus, the children are taken away. This picture recently went viral. It is from the Shanghai Clinic Center for Public Health. Dozens of children are being kept here. The wards and hallways are crowded. Two to three kids share the same bed, and their parents are nowhere to be seen. Chinese treatment protocols have come under fire too. Instead of tried and tested drugs, Chinese authorities are pushing unproven cures like honeysuckle, rhubarb root, and sweet wormwood herb. Beijing is sending these cures to their allies too. Specialists in Chinese medicine have been dispatched to Cambodia and Pakistan. High volume of cases, office quarantines, and the use of unproven cures. These factors are creating an environment for the virus to thrive. They are a threat not just for Chinese citizens, but for the rest of the world too. That could be forced to fight another virus from China. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.